Endgame book claims Queen Camilla thanked Piers Morgan for Meghan Markle Pinocchio Princess Dis. Welcome to my channel Royal Family Lid. According to Mid Scobie's Endgame, Queen Camilla quietly thanked Piers Morgan for referring to Meghan Markle as a Pinocchio Princess. In his most recent royal biography, published on Tuesday, November 28th, Scobie, 42, discusses Morgan, 58, criticizing Meghan, 41, over time. Morgan stated on Good Morning Britain that he wouldn't believe Meghan if she read me a weather report after she disclosed that she suffered with suicide thoughts. Please share my video thank you. After Meghan and viewers alike complained to broadcast network ITV, Morgan resigned from GMB amid growing demand to issue an apology. In a Daily Mail essay, he then called Meghan a Princess Pinocchio, emulating the Disney figure who is infamous for having a problem with honesty. In September 2021, Morgan stated, I was reliably informed recently that Meghan Markle wrote directly to my ITV boss, Dame Carolyn McCall, the night before I was forced out, demanding my head on a plate. What has happened to the world that a pouting, sour-tongued actress can decide who hosts a morning TV news show? Since then, whenever Morgan talks about the incident on his ex, formerly Twitter, page he has called Meghan Princess Pinocchio. Scotty claims that 76-year-old Camilla thanked Morgan in a note for defending the firm. After that, a palace official informed royal expert Scoby that Camilla would never discuss the issue in public or speak ill of others. According to reports, the royal insider expressed gratitude to Scoby for someone standing up to Meghan's assertions. Thus Weekly has contacted Camilla's representatives in regards to the allegations. Despite not responding to Morgan's comments or her mother-in-law's purported behavior, Meghan has the backing of her 39-year-old husband, Harry. I implore her to stop speaking in such manner. I assured her that we would overcome it and find a solution. The Duke of Sussex wrote, We'd find her the help she needed in the interim, in his spare memoir, which was released in January. I told her to hold on, please be strong. Since resigning from their high-ranking positions in 2020, Harry and Meghan, who have a son named Prince Archie and a daughter named Princess Lilibet, have had disagreements with members of the royal family. King Charles I. Weedy, the father of Harry, and Camilla have been wed since 2005. Harry and 75-year-old Charles presently have a chilly relationship and don't talk often. Please subscribe my channel thank you. Dial 988 to reach the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline if you or someone you know is thinking about taking their own life.